Dr. Hamlet Franklin. Yes, Dr. Laura Franklin. <clears throat> can we talk? Well, I see you can. And I know I can, so I suppose we can. Smarty. Hey, didn't become a doctor by being a dummy. Very funny. So what's on your mind? So, you know that research position that they offered me at the med center? Yeah, sweet gig. What about it? Well, I was thinking about not taking it. What? I'm thinking about turning it down. But that was your dream job. <laughs> I know. I know. I was aiming for it since I was in high school. And to be offered it at such an early age in my career, it's like a dream come true. It's just that right now, I'm not certain that it's the best thing. What? What's not to be certain about? I mean, heading up the cancer research program? Getting to do the research that you want? With all the resources of the system at your disposal, just for the asking. And not to mention the boosted salary and all the whining and dining by the pharmaceutical companies? I know. I don't think I haven't considered all of that. So then what? Did you get another offer? No. No other offer. Then what? Stay at your current job? I, why would you want that? Well, actually, I was, I was thinking about leaving that, too. What? Quit the clinic? To do what? Private practice? Maybe. That could be a possibility. Maybe work part-time. <laughs> okay, wait. Wait a minute there. What, what's going on? I'm pregnant. What? <laughs> I said I'm pregnant. Whoa, 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 whoa. How did that happen? Didn't you get any sex education in all of that schooling of yours? Ha, ha. Man, I can't believe this. How? Did you forget to take the pill? No. Well, then how? It's not 100% effective. Oh, boy. This is just great. Just what we need. So what? You quit your job and become a mom? It's great. I mean, we just bought this place. How are we supposed to... There's no way that we can afford this on my salary alone. Ham, I'm not saying that you have to do it all on your own. It'll be a few months until I have to stop working. And a few months after the baby's born, I can work part-time. How are we supposed to survive while you're not working? I mean, we have a house payment, car payment, boat payment, utility bills. I mean, they don't just stop, you know. We'll have to make some adjustments. Adjustments? What adjustments? We are going to have to learn how to do without some things. I don't like the sound of that. What's the alternative? Do you want me to lose this baby? This is our child, Ham. He or she deserves to have a life. To have a mom to nurture him, to have a father, to love him, protect him, and guide him. Or her. Yes. This is going to be tough. Tougher than anything I have ever done before tougher than anything either of us has done before. But it's worth the effort. You really think so? Yeah. Ham. Yeah? I love you. I had no doubt. Smart Alec. <laughs> Wait a minute. I gotta get used to this.